within this service, whenever we complete any type of assessment, we use a strength-based approach, meaning that we focus on what the individual can do, what their strengths are, rather than purely what their limitations and difficulties are. We're currently embracing different types of technology within Surrey to enhance and supplement this process, empowering people to remain as independent as possible and staying at home with the least intrusive intervention. I'm what is called a trusted advisor and my role is to attend your house and to make an informed decision on what technology enabled care equipment we might be able to offer you. We now have a, a new piece of technology which is called the Home Safe Connected Care Technology. This is a range of little sensors and these are very, very small, very unobtrusive sensors that we can place around your home. There is no wiring, there's no cabling, they are quite literally stuck up to the wall or a piece of wood or somewhere around the door frame. And these little sensors, they're just monitoring your motion, they detect temperature and they detect light levels. I work with the individual to set short-term goals looking at their current strengths and what they wish to achieve and what is most important to them based on their previous lifestyle and what current support they have available to them. We completed a home visit recently to a lady who had just come home from hospital. This resulted in her lost confidence in being able to complete all the daily tasks that were very important to her, as an example, being able to make a cup of tea. Therefore, one of the sensors was installed in the kitchen and this enabled us to monitor activities within the kitchen and also giving reassurance to the lady that anything untoward would be monitored and picked up. So whether you have a support package in place or not, this also provides that extra reassurance that there's any inactivity or any difficulty with you managing these tasks that will be picked up on and can cause a trigger, for example a phone call to your family or someone who's able to contact you and just make sure that everything's okay. So once the tech has been installed and we've set the goals for the individual, it's important to know that we make it very personal to the individual and almost tailor-made in order to know what we're looking at on the data to set off any triggers and alerts. Any of the technology is not intrusive, it's just there as a supplement to enable people to live at home as independently as possible for as long as possible.